Hey, I'm Dylan from Aftershock PC, and today I'm gonna to be running you through how to reseat all of your internal power cables. Sometimes power cables can become loose in transit. If they aren't seated correctly, you can experience issues such as random shutdowns, PC not displaying, or simply just not turning on at all. First, let's power off your PC, switch off the power supply, unplug everything from the rear and the front of your PC, and lay it down glass up on a mat or towel to prevent any damage to the case. Remove the side panel from your PC, it may be glass like this with four screws. Other cases have other ways of holding the door down. Some come on a hinge, others have screws on the back. The connections we'll check first are the CPU, GPU, and motherboard. First, the CPU power cable, usually located on the top left. You should see one or two thick eight pin cable connectors here. Inspect the latch and the connector to see if it's locked in. This is locked and this is unlocked. If unlocked, you need to hold the plastic connector and push it in towards the PC. You'll hear and feel a click. Double check the latch again to make sure it's locked. Next, the motherboard power cable. It's a wide rectangular 24 pin connector and will be on the right hand side of the motherboard. Again, check if the latch is locked or unlocked. Hold and push the connector towards the PC if it was unlocked. Now the GPU power cables, which are the one to three thick eight pin cables in front of the GPU closest to you. Check the latch and secure it if unlocked. If you have an adapter cable, it's important to make sure the connector is fully seated and there are no gaps between the clips. You'll need to check the three latches on the other end of the adapter as well. Now we have to check the connectors on the rear of the case. Flip the PC upright and remove the back panel by unscrewing the one or two thumb screws at the back of the PC and sliding it backwards till it pops off. If you've got colored cable sleeve extensions, you'll need to check the connections to the power supply cables. If you can't see them straight away, simply trace along to the cables to find the connectors. Now check each one, CPU, motherboard, and GPU cables. Check the latches to see if you need to lock them. Push the two connectors together and double check the latch to see if they're seated correctly. Lastly, if you have a modular power supply, you'll need to check the connectors on the power supply itself. If not, you can just skip this step. Locate the power supply at the top or bottom at the rear of the case. Carefully push the connectors so you can reach towards the power supply to check if those are clicked in all the way. We recommend checking only the ones that you can reach with ease. Now that's all done, put both front and back panels back on, plug everything back in and turn on the PC to see if it's all working correctly. If you're still having issues with your PC, get in touch with one of our friendly staff. We're always happy to help.